Hello everyone. Welcome to Markbank. In the previous video, we learned as to how to use a formula called any formula. We also learned that this is used in successive percentile changes. Now we are going to apply that formula over here. Uh, in this particular problem, it says that there are two shops. Shop A offers a 15% plus 15% discount, and Shop B offers a flat 30% discount. My question is, which shop we should be going as a customer? At the very first glance, it might seem that both of them are offering the same discount. But let us solve it. Say shop number. I'm just talking about shop A. I'm talking about shop A. Shop A offers 15% plus 15% discount. So in this case, A is what negative of 15%. Why do we write it to be negative 15%? Because this is discount. Discount is nothing but decrement. Alright. Another B comes out as negative of 15%. So as per AB formula for cumulative percentile change, I should be using this formula. That comes out as what? Negative of 15% followed by another negative 15% plus negative 15 times negative 15 over 100 percent right now if you solve it if you solve it you're going to have a negative of 27.75 percent so shop a is offering you a total discount of 27.75 percent discount how much is shop b offering you Shop B is offering you a flat 30% discount. A flat 30% discount. So which shop is offering you more discount? It is very very clear over here that shop B is offering you more discount. Because if you assume that there is a there is a product and its value is 100 rupees, shop B will give it to you for 70 rupees. But shop A will not give you at 70 rupees. Shop A is going to charge you something more than 70 rupees. Hence, why should I be going to a shop which is going to give me something which is costly? I should be going to shop B. Does this make sense to you? So when I say that 15% plus 15% discount, I am trying to say that this is nothing but successive discount. First, you will be given 15% discount and then whatever value will remain 15% of that will be given to you hence you must have you must have gone to shops like 50% plus 50% discount and then they they make this asterisk over here this discount what exactly is the meaning of 50% plus 50% discount are they selling you for free no they are not so if a shop is offering a 50% plus 50% discount, first say for example, say for example, there is a t-shirt and the value of the t-shirt is 100 rupees. The tag price of the t-shirt is given to you as 100 rupees. So first you will be given 50%, 50% of 100%. So how much is 50% of 100 rupees? That comes out as 50 rupees. Then, then whatever value will be left, you will calculate 50% of that value. That comes out as 25. Hence, the total discount will be will be 75 rupees. And hence, the billing price of the T-shirt will be 25 rupees. It is not going to be zero rupees. It is 25 rupees. So, in some other language, can we can we say that? If a shopkeeper is giving me 50% plus 50% discount, is he not giving me a total of 75% discount? Right? So, if we apply our AB formula, in this case what is given? A is given to you as a negative of 50 and B is also given to you as negative of 50. And if you apply AB formula, what is that you are going to get? This is what you are going to have. Please solve it and you will you will come to know that this value comes out as negative of 75%.
So what is the meaning of negative 75 percent? That the shop is giving me 75 percent discount and hence I should be paying to 25 percent of the value to the shopkeeper. I hope you are understanding this. All right. In the next video, we are going to solve some questions on on geometrical figures. So see you in the next video. Bye bye and take care.